Good morning everyone, it is currently Sunday morning so best believe that we're chilling in bed right now. Um, I'm actually just watching Celebs Go Dating, just made myself a cup of tea, cannot stop the morning without a cup of tea. Um, I actually slept with my hair in a pot last night and it was so much easier, I'm definitely going to start doing this um, because there's literally no frizz at all, it stayed like so, like I was going to say straight, I mean like um, sleek, like not frizzy, I don't know what the other word is but yeah it's just like stayed really nice so yeah i'm definitely gonna start doing that um i've also got these biscuits i'm obsessed with these biscuits right now they are the asda original molly milk i feel like such a little grandma like there's nothing else to do on a sunday morning anymore you know this was the time when we used to go for brunch we used to go shopping we used to have lazy days with people we don't have them anymore we used to be hungover. I don't remember what a hangover feels like. No, I, I really do and I don't want one. But um, yeah, I just miss every aspect of life. Um, but yeah, I'm probably gonna watch a couple of episodes of this because I think I've nearly, nearly finished the series. So I wanna try and finish it um, because I've been watching a lot of it recently, like a lot of back-to-back -back episodes. But like I said last night, if anyone has got any, um, like telly or netflix recommendations i would really really appreciate it because i'm bored out of my head um, most days um but yeah i could have content day today but then i've got enough content for like the next two three weeks so i kind of want to just have a bit of a chill day i think um a little bit of a pamper probably gonna have a bath fake tan paint my nails that type of day um so yeah i don't know how much i'm gonna be vlogging today but i will try also because it's sunday i have a video actually going up today so i need to make sure that's ready to go up i'm pretty sure it is i need to add like the caption and stuff but i'm probably gonna upload it in the next maybe hour because it's currently one one or two p.m you wouldn't think so you'd think it was like 8 a.m but yeah it's like one or two um so i'm gonna probably get that up in the next hour while i'm watching this um and yeah that's it basically um uh, let me know what you're doing on your guys sunday um i've also realized it's mother's day soon it is today is the 21st of february but it's mother's day in just under a month's time so i've been trying to think what i want to get my mum. um obviously i am partnering up with roots hair extensions now so i was thinking i might treat her to some hair extensions um she always complains that her hair is too thin and she's never ever worn them before so i feel like getting some like shorter ones like short hair extensions just to add a little bit of length but like more thickness for her she might like so yeah i think i might maybe get her some of them as like a little present like when we origin what when we can start going for meals and things again I th she does like to like dress up a bit so i think something like that she might like um I'm also thinking of maybe getting a like a candle or some flowers. She really wants a bag, but the bag that she wants is like six, seven hundred pounds. So yeah, unless I can get all my siblings on board with me, I don't know if that's gonna happen. <laughs> um, but yeah, if anyone has got any Mother's Day ideas as well, actually, let me know because usually I'd just do something instead. Like we'd usually get like go for maybe go for a meal or go like I don't know. Just that type of thing so yeah if you've got any ideas let me know hi guys so did you guess it i've done absolutely nothing today i have almost finished celebs go dating currently still in my pajamas run a bath so i'm about to jump in it and make some cheese on toast and that is the highlight of my day i haven't even posted my youtube video yet but i've still got a few hours left to post it so probably gonna post it while i'm in the bath probably just do a little bit of stuff on my phone i want to look on amazon for some room bits because i've kind of decided that i want to well i've been trying to do it for a while but i want to infuse a little bit more white in this room i've actually managed to just pop my mirror up there it's with the temporary red ribbon i'm going to order some cream or white or whatever and change that um but this is great for like, well, outfit pictures, just using in general. Um, I actually love that it's not attached to the wall because I take it off a lot um, and use it to, like as a mirror to curl my hair with. Um, I take photos with it like around the house. So this is a really good movable mirror for me because basically this one, it doesn't move. It's I mean, it does move if I really wanted to, but it's so heavy that I can't physically really move it. Um, 
also do you think i should keep the flowers on there because i do really like them but i don't know i'm just not sure i feel like they're going a little bit funny like they're falling down a little bit they need fixing back up but yeah let me know what you think about that i don't know if i could put them anywhere else that's the only thing um but yeah i'm possibly thinking of moving this little chair maybe getting a white bedside table um possibly maybe getting a white storage box instead of a gray one but it needs a clear out just that because there's just loads of crap in it i never use it i never go into it and get things out so it's just stuff that i don't really need i guess so yeah i think i'm probably gonna have a look through there and see what i want to get rid of i've got a lot of like cards from like past birthdays i've got a lot of like random things like notepads stationery um like boxes that my camera came in my macbook came in things like that that i just don't really need so i'm probably going to get rid of a lot of stuff in there also behind here ex excuse the like oh poly props because i am using that but i've got a lot of bags like juicy couture stuff like that it takes up a lot of space this is basically my promo box so things that i get sent stay in here until i take pictures obviously it would be super handy if i did have a spare room you know like a little walk-in wardrobe or spare room or like office or something that i could put things like this in but obviously Obviously, I don't have anything like this because I live at home with my parents, so obviously one day I will, fingers crossed, but um, for now, I have to obviously work, live, everything in one room, um, so that's why, you know, there's receipts everywhere, this all needs cleaning up, but there's like receipts everywhere, um, just stuff everywhere that I don't know where to put, um, so yeah, it needs a good clean, well, just needs to sort out really decide where things are going but i'm gonna jump in the bath and then see what i order on amazon if i do or see if i find anything that's nice so i've literally just got out of the bath and i've kind of like made some good decisions in the bath i feel like it's a good like time to think so on amazon i've ordered um the little book of dr um publishing group book it is adorable it's so cute i cannot wait for it to come to show you because it looks so cute i got some white ribbon um to go on my uh, mirror up there and then i also got the modern and chic real pink feather table lamp um i thought this was going to be so cute for my bedside table that i've ordered as well i'm going to show you that in a sec so this is so cute because my lamp up there is white um, sorry it's so blurry but um yeah I thought pink would look cute like against that wall um so I've got a little pink one I'm really excited for this lamp I think it's gonna look so cute and I'm gonna show you the table now so I ordered a bedside table from this website which is furniture.co.uk um I literally just searched for well I searched around for about two hours but I searched for crystal I wanted like a French-esque bedside table uh, that was white it had to be white not ivory and also i wanted preferably maybe crystal knobs because these are crystal on here so i thought it would look cute um so yeah these are a lot that came up i did have a look on amazon as well um i like this one but it's just a little bit too high and a bit expensive i didn't really need one like that so i actually went for this one which is in the sale for 139 pounds um I'm really excited about this because I haven't had a bedside table for a very, very long time. It's going to be a little bit of a game changer. Um, I've made sure to get quite a small one, but it's got three nice drawers, which are really nice. So I'm going to be able to free up a few of these drawers. So I'm going to be able to put like makeup wipes um, and like moisturiser and like things like that in these drawers, which I'm really excited about because these are going to be like for next to my bed and like chargers and stuff. I think it's going to be so helpful. Um, I'm also planning what I'm going to have on top, so I'm going to have a little candle, um, so I can take my candle off there, because I can actually have my candle next to me in bed and actually turn it off, well, blow it out when I'm in bed, which I'm so excited about, because I always have to get out of bed to turn it off, um, I'm going to have a little bedside table lamp, which I'm so excited about, obviously the one I just bought, um, I'm properly excited about that, because at the minute I literally just have my fairy lights, that's all I have in this room um and the fairy lights are adorable but they like aren't very bright or anything and at night it does get very very dark with just the fairy lights on 
Um, as you can tell, it's currently 5pm and my room is very, very dark right now. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited about this. It said it's going to come within the next week and a half. So I can't wait to update you guys when it's here. A little bedroom makeover. Um, I didn't buy too many things. I bought like two, three things. But yeah, I've got a lot of things already in my bedroom that I'm going to move to this. So there's not really much decorating I need to do. I've also got my mirror that I need to put up that I bought at my dad's. Um, I'm going to go and get it out of the garage now and pop it in my room. I think I'm going to put it up here. Um, obviously just so it's in my bedroom. Um, and I can see it and I can plan where it's going to go. So yeah, I'm going to go grab that now. I can't believe my wardrobe is literally bursting at the seams again. I have no clue what to do because I had so many, so many, so many, so many clothes clear outs recently. I mean, the bottom shelf isn't too bad at all because I have like loads of bags. I've got like three overnight bags behind here. Look, I've got all my beauty stuff at the bottom, but it's going to be so handy because as soon as I get this bedside table here, I'm going to have... Um, a few of these drawers spare so I can actually unclutter them because when I tell you these are cluttered I mean that one isn't too bad but like they need a massive tidy and massive sort out so much makeup needs to go I don't use any of these drawers because I don't do makeup anymore I used to do a lot of like makeup artistry and stuff so like all these drawers are just shoved full look at these like they're just so full this one is just too much there's because this is basically the only drawer i use there's everything in there but i don't use any of this makeup or anything so it needs a massive sort out um honestly every one is bad every single one of them is bad so they need a massive except this one this one's pretty organized but they all need a massive organization um so yeah it needs a massive sort out plus this is so cluttered up here but like i said as soon as i get the bedside table i'll be able to move these are long so I'm going to have my coasters on there so I can have my tea on it. My candle's going to be over there so these are going to be more spaced out. Like my cards are just there because it's been Valentine's Day but it's going to be a lot more spacious around here. It's going to be very exciting and because these are going to be more spacious then I'll be able to move all this stuff over because I've got like nail polishes, bits like that. They'll all be able to go in here. It's an exciting time guys, exciting. I love decluttering. So yeah, this is the room at the moment, um, so yeah. So we're cleaning the drawers first drawer is empty and this is what we've got from the drawer we've got this makeup we've got jewelry and we've got hair so i need to section these out thinking probably makeup again for this one with probably well yeah i think makeup for this so i need to go through these makeup products make sure there's definitely some in each make sure they're worth keeping get rid of anything that's gone off look there's so many new like p louise stuff like this in here that i haven't even used obviously some foundations need chucking but we'll see what we keep. Day. makeup is all sorted so all these foundations have a good amount of product in um i've got a little tester there i've got p louise bases that are literally brand new some of these foundations are brand new this contour sticks brand new some of them are half used but the thing is that only for me now i used to do makeup artistry and i don't obviously do it anymore so i don't really mind using these plus um they're good for mixing shades so i have a few different shades here some are quite darker than me some are lighter than me like this one um 
but what we do is we mix the shades so it works pretty well um i can use the contour sticks i've got new concealers there as well so i'm just going to keep all these because i know they'll all come in and it'll save me money than buying new um and then these are all my primers i actually don't use a primer so i need to actually start using one so i'm probably going to pick one of these and start using it on my everyday makeup routine so we've got primers from um laurie is it what's this one laurie oh maybelline we've got a uh, primark that's a mac one there so i'm probably going to start using this just to use it up first then this one is from aura and then we've got a little sample of the professional so yeah i'm probably going to pop this little mac one into my makeup bag start using them so i've freed up this little one here got a few little lip balms and setting spray left but i'll put them in a different one i might as well start using this setting spray as well to use it up so i'm gonna put a few bits in my makeup bags now um so yeah making a good start so first draw is all clean and tidy uh next draw just emptied it so i'm gonna clean it down but this is what was in the next draw so we've got all these eyebrow products this is gel from when i got my lips done so i mean a lot of this stuff needs to be thrown we've got a uh, highlighter there that has literally fully fallen apart needs to be chucked i've got loads of different bronzers highlighters then we've got all these lipsticks look at all these mac lipsticks i'm pretty sure these are all empty as well and i know you used to be able to trade these in but i think with covid this is probably you probably can't do it anymore so i might as well just chuck them so yeah <laughs> watch me tidy up So we're all organised now, I've chucked so much stuff, like the amount of lipsticks and stuff I've chucked in here, obviously this was all like crap stuff, empty stuff, stuff that's gone off. Um, I've actually made a little selling pile as well for all the new things that I've never opened, so I've got P. Louise I've never opened, brand new pomades, these two as well, they don't have the boxes but they are brand new, brand new lip liner, all these are obviously sealed and things. So yeah, I'm going to pop these on my Depop um, because I don't wear makeup of these colours. Um, obviously I did used to do makeup out to drain things and I don't I just bought every single shade of everything and I don't use them so I mean I'm probably gonna offer them to my mum first if she declines then they'll be going on my Depop so yeah if anyone would like them go and check out my Depop I've just thought if these don't sell on my Depop I'm gonna include them in my 50k giveaway because this is quite a good collection of lipsticks and things and uh, eyebrow things obviously the peel away peel Louise is very expensive as well so these are quite a good giveaway prize don't you think so these might be good with my 50k giveaway guys the third draw needs big tlc but for now i'm just going to show you these two so this is the first one so fast this is basically a full makeup draw which i'm really happy with i do have like matches and stuff here but when i get my bedside table they'll go in there um but yeah i'm really really happy about that obviously i can squish some more bits in there as well and the next one is basically a lipstick draw there is a lot of space still left in these drawers so there's all my lipsticks here and then we've got jewelry compartment i'm so happy i now have enough space for my jewellery in one box obviously it will be better with a little makeup box but we can always think about that another time um, and then my hoops didn't fit so they're just there as well so yeah that's it so far I'm really really happy with how they're looking um, the next draw is going to be a little bit of a problem so I'm going to crack on with that now and then these ones are a little bit easier but there is so much to get rid of in these so yeah <laughs> 
<laughs> just decided to light my Yankee summer scoop candle while I'm organizing because I need to burn it out honestly I use it so much and I'm just a bit sick of the smell now um, and I want to crack on to my other ones so I'm trying to burn it out um, but yeah this is how, what we're up to we're on to the third draw so I'm gonna come back to you when this is done <laughs> and we're back surprise uh, they're in here now um, so yeah that's all I kept all the rest are in the bin <laughs> but yeah i was gonna sell these because they are all brand new but then i thought like when my lash extensions come off i'll be annoyed that i didn't keep them so i've kept them i've got a uh, lash glue in there plus like when friends come and stuff like after lockdown people tend to just ask if i've got lashes so there they are ready guys it is a couple hours later now and the bin is full again the bin bag is pretty full this is all for sale this is going on my depop like all the new hair stuff uh we've got um peaches and cream uh we've got peaches and cream eyeshadows i got my hazala hair extensions out to sort um but yeah i can't believe i've done the whole of this and i've got one draw free um every single one is organized literally every single one so yeah what a transformation. The bottom one is now hair stuff that actually fits all my curling wand and everything in. I'm so excited. So happy. Everything's in there. 